We end our Planet Early series today with some tips to keep your energy bills from rising as high as the temperatures this summer. Carter Osterhaus is host of Carter Can on HGTV. How are you doing Good. this morning? How are you doing? It's so nice. It's starting to feel like spring I here. know, right? It's going to get a little bit warmer. Temperatures out. rising yes. around the country. So we're going to give a couple tips that you know people can do every day just Simple to lower things. those costs. The, yeah. the energy bill at the end of the month. Yeah. And if any of these things are way too hard, again, people can go to servicelive.com where people can actually name the price and get somebody. And that's from the East Coast to the West Coast. That's another thing that we're working with, which is pretty cool. So cool website. Right? Very cool website. All right, all right. Some of these things that we're doing, uh, air conditioning unit. You can yep. lower your cost if you look for the Energy Star rated yep. AC unit from those old units that you know are very archaic. You can lower your energy cost 30%. Huge, very easy to huge do. Huge difference. Huge difference. And these are only about $150. Mm -hmm. There are energy credits that you can get also. Yeah, if sometimes you, go for you get the, a tax rebate. A tax or rebate if yeah. you go for the bigger units. Yeah. So that's something simple to do. Yeah. Saved you a lot. If of money. you've had one of those that's been in your window for ten years, <laughs> yes, probably you may time to really to, think about exactly. Yeah. Probably time to get that out of there. It's there a little go. old, a little dated. Okay. Uh, filters. Filters cost less than twenty dollars, but you should change them every three to six months. Right. Um, you know, make sure you take your old filter out when you want to just check the size to make yeah. sure the new one's going to fit. People forget about that. They forget about it, but it's going to clean your air quality in your home. You're going to save about five percent in energy. If they're bills. clean. Can if I just clean. do one other thing? Yeah. In your air conditioner, people forget there's a that filter there is a filter in, in the smaller if AC If you don't unit. change that, yes. it can really cause and, serious problems. And, and it's harder on the AC unit itself. Yeah. So with your filter, you're gonna, your, fil your AC units are going to run a whole yeah. lot more efficiently. Okay, so I have my new air conditioner. I've yeah. got my clean filter. <laughs> you got everything. This. Ceiling fans. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, ceiling fans are something that... Uh, I love ceiling fans. I'm a huge fan of it. But what they're going to do is you're going to be able to raise your temperature on your AC unit four right. degrees if you have a ceiling fan, and you're going to have that same comfort in your house. Right. And a ceiling fan's only about a dollar. Um, it's a dollar so an much hour to run. cheaper so, to run this. Yes. The the difference in cost by running this and and turning that right. thermostat higher. Higher. Really so you're money. not wasting a bunch of money on right. your AC unit yeah. with a ceiling fan, which is what about sixty dollars in your yeah. home. You know, that's pretty inexpensive. So these are go. little tips that you can take home so that energy bill is cut at the end of the month. Yeah, there are all these big football players who are I signing know. autographs on the football. There's a woman over there who wants you to oh, sign an air, air filter, filter for her. Where? I, I couldn't <laughs> find her. I was lucky. I could see her. <laughs> Carter, thank you so much. Thank you. Appreciate you it. You can catch Carter Can on HGTV. And for more information on these money-saving tips, go to our website at earlyshow.cbsnews.com.